our laboratory uh, network is monitoring and following all changes in the virus. Um, and as you know, there are, I, I don't know exactly as many today, more than 80,000 full genome sequences that are currently available. Um, it, most of these mutations don't cause greater or lesser infectivity or severity. So we have a special working group that we have formed. Uh, we're actually looking at how do we better understand what these mutations mean in terms of the way that they behave. A vaccine will be a vital tool, and we hope that we will have one as soon as possible. But there is no guarantee that we will. And even if we do have a vaccine, it wouldn't end the pandemic on its own. We must all learn to control and manage this virus using the tools we have now, and to make the adjustments to our daily lives that are needed to keep ourselves and each other safe.